the signum function f from r to r given by given by f of x is equal to 1 if x is greater than 0 if x is greater than 0 x is greater than 0 0 if x is 0 minus 1 if x is less than 0 is neither 1 to 1 nor odd to neither 1 to 1 nor on to. Once again, it is a very simple problem. See, you can easily, I mean, uh, understand this. You can easily verify whether it is on to 1 and on to. See, once again, we have got this sig signum function. See, it is a 0, 0. 0 means 0. 1 means 1. 2 means, see, this is 1. 2 means 1, 3, 1. Therefore, this is the signum function. Similarly, minus 1, 1, minus 1, 2, minus 1, minus 3, minus 1. Therefore, this is signum function. Now, we have f of 1 is what? 1. And what is f of 2? That is also 1. Okay for x greater than 0, f of x is 1. So, for all x greater than 0, f of x is 1. So, just to take one example, f of 1 is what? 1. What is f of 2? 1. Now, that implies f of 1 equal to f of 2. Correct? This implies 1 not equal to 2. That is, once again, f of x 1 equal to f of x 2 x 1 not equal to x 2. Therefore, f is not 1 to 1. f is not 1 to 1. Followed? Then, for uh, on to, it is very simple. See, range of f, range of f is equal to minus 1, 0, 1. Only 3 elements. So, this is not equal to R, that is co-domain. Therefore, F is not on to. F is not on to. Follow the point. A function F from R to R given by f of x is equal to 1 plus x square verify or find whether find whether f is 1 to 1 and on to it was asked in March 2017 as a 2 marks question. So, a function f from r to r given by f of x is equal to 1 plus x square. Find whether f is 1 to 1 and on to. Now, it is very simple. You have to find whether f is 1 to 1 and on to. Now, look here. First write what is f of x? 1 plus x square. Correct? Now, f of x is equal to 1 plus x square. First, what is f of 1? With the examples only we can write. f of 1, 1 plus x square, 1 plus 1. What is f of minus 1? 1 plus minus 1 square, 2. That is, f of 1 equal to f of minus 1. So, this implies 1 not equal to minus 1. That is, f of x 1 equal to f of x 2 implies x 1 not equal to x 2. Therefore, f is not 
1 to 1, f is not 1 to 1. Followed. Next, see we can write this is r to r just for your understanding say 0 1 2 3 minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 all rationals reals all are there 0 1 2 3 minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 etc. Now x is equal to 0 0 means it is what 1 x equal to 1 x equal to minus 1, x equal to 2, 2 means 5, x equal to minus 2, 5. So, now what do you find? What is this uh, range of f? What is the range of f? Tell me. What is the range? Range is equal to, uh, it cannot be equal to 0. So, range is equal to 1 to infinity. Why? All I mean a real numbers from 1 to infinity. Okay? So, it is 1 to infinity. Is it equal to r? Is it equal to r? r is total real number minus infinity to plus infinity. What is r? Minus infinity to plus infinity. But here negative real numbers up to 1 are negative real numbers plus 0 to 1 are not included. So, it is the range is plus 1 to infinity. Therefore, it is not equal to r. r is codomain. Therefore, f is not on 2. f is not on 2. Uh, complete this uh, 1 to 1 and 1 to by x taking up one more example. Let f from n to n be defined by f of n equal to n plus 1 by 2 if n is odd and odd for all n belongs to n then n by 2 if n is e 1 n is e 1 n is e 1 state whether state whether the function is bijective state whether the function is bijective Bijective means both 1 to 1 and 1 to. Okay, bijective means the function must be both 1 to 1 and 1 to. Now, first, let us write, say we have to verify the function for 1 to 1. What is that? 1 to 1 means what? First, you write, say f of 1, then f of 2 because I am taking elements from n. Now, what is f of 1? 1? 1 is odd. See, read this. 1 is odd. So, then it is 1 plus 1 by 2. n is odd. Therefore, what is that? It is 1 plus 1 by 2. Then f of 2, n is e 1. So, it is 2 by 2, 1. That is f of 1 equal to f of 2 implies 1 not equal to 2. That is f of x 1 equal to f of x 2 implies therefore f is not 1 to 1. f is not 1 to 1. Okay? Then verify for on to range of f. Look here range of f. n to n 1 2 3 4 5 etc 1 2 3 4 5 etc see 1 means 1 2 means 1 f of 3 3 plus 1 by 2 2 4 is 2 5 is 3 
6 is 3, 7 is 4, 8 is 4. Therefore, range of f is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, etcetera. What is that? N. This is codomain. Okay. It is codomain. Understood? See, we have got range of f is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, etcetera up to n. That means, it is equal to n. What is this? Codomain. So, range of the function is equal to codomain. Thus, f is what? f is on 2. Okay. Thus, we can find f is on 2. So, I hope this idea is clear. So, both 1 to 1 and on 2. I think you have got clear information, clear ideas about the function. So, we have to solve problems in the next section. That is, we have to prove the function is invertible and hence finding inverse. So, it is actually a compulsory 5 marks question of the question paper. So, it can be solved with the help of 1 to 1 and on 2.